Ah, <laughs> but you know, I I wanted to. <laughs> but yeah, let's get on to Final Fantasy. That's what we're here for. <laughs> this is something I do have control over. And this is something that I am gonna enjoy. So, uh, yeah. That is that. We're currently going through the Macalania, Macalania woods. And, uh, we're on our way to go to the Mac Macalania temple to meet with Ma Maester Seymour because he wants to marry Yuna. Yuna apparently. Welcome. Allegedly is gonna say yes. I mean, everyone sure seems to believe that they're gonna be get married, you know what I mean? So, you know, it's like, what do I know, right? Um, why does Riku need magic? <laughs> why does Riku need magic plus five? Why is that a thing? Uh, I don't think it's too expensive. I just didn't care about any of the things you were selling, sweetie, but you know. It, it's fine. Also, let me know if the game is too quiet. I want it to be quieter than me, but I obviously don't want it louder, like, louder than me. Like, I don't, I want it so that you guys can hear it. Oh, there you go. Am I getting all the primers? So far, I think... So far, I think I'm not missing any. So that's iconic. That's pretty iconic, isn't it? Isn't it? Wait. It is here. Somewhere. What's here? Something you should see. But oh. Sir Oren... It won't take long. She's like, bitch, I have places to go. <laughs> She's like, I'm very busy, Oren. Queen of breaking down a tree with a sword. Who needs a fucking um, axe when you have a fucking sword? I was gonna make a joke about Orin and Wood, but you know, I think it's too early in the stream for that. <laughs> I think it's too early in the stream for that. Or I'm I'm just not in the mood. I don't know. I'm not like mad. But I'm like, you know, I'm I'm not I'm not in my best mood. <laughs> this place. It's just water, isn't it? This is what spheres are made of. This is what spheres are spheres made of. Memories. Sorry. What's that? Oh, sweetie. Fiends are also attracted to these places. <laughs> Wood. Mm hmm. Yes. <laughs> Can we get... Oh, it's immune to sensors? Well, fuck my drag. Um... Okay, Riku. Steel. Can I do scan? Because I think there's a pattern here. Oh shit, it's immune. Okay, got it. It's just the blizzard. I think this is the one creature that, like, when you attack it, it switches the elements that it's strong against or weak against or whatever the fuck. Either way, I'm gonna uh, overdrive as Orin. <laughs> like, either way, I don't care. Oh, that was weak. <laughs> Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Um. Well then, we're gonna try. 
Oh, we can try slowing it down. That's a thing. Yeah, that's a thing we can do. Oh, it's immune. Stunning, okay. Lovely. Can Kimari Lancet this, honey? Not really, okay. Go on. Okay, I mean, if we, if we can't slow this honey down, we can at least speed our, our honeys up, so... Do we want to speed any of these up, to be honest? Like, to be completely honest, I guess Titas. Okay, Kimari, do the fire breath thing. There you go. There we go, now it's shifting to something else. Yeah, but it's immune to sensor, so I don't know how we're gonna figure out what it's gonna do, but um, I think we're just gonna steal again as Riku until there's nothing left. I'm pretty sure there's something juicy that this honey is holding. I am pretty sure there's something juicy. Before I do something crazy though, I'm gonna need to like attack just to see what kind of uh, counter it does. Thunder, got it, okay. Because it's Thunder, we're gonna overdrive as Lulu, and we're gonna do Watera. Watera. Oh, it's the right stick. Oh my god. Oh, this is difficult. Oh my god. Well, that was a flop. <laughs> She's gonna switch to something else. And it's okay, because we still have Riku to steal shit from, from it. Yes, Lulu, evade it. Yes. Okay, now it's fire. Got it. Because she's doing fire, we're going to have Waka, and we're going to try and do Blizzard on the element reels. I don't know how well I'm going to be able to pull that off, but sh we failed completely. Okay. Shit, we failed completely. It's fine. <laughs> We got a good attack out of it. It's okay. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> oh, we can do Riku stuff. If you guys haven't seen her overdrive yet. Basically, she mixes up two items. So we can mix up like a grenade, for example, and like a... What does she have? Does she have any fire stuff? Protect, d delays, next turn on all enemies. There seems to be any use for this. Petrifies, shell, lightning damage, lightning, ice, sleep, poison, water. Yeah, she doesn't really have fire damage. Um, hmm. I guess we can do grenade and like... Oh, I don't know. Okay, we're just gonna save this until we, we we can do a better one. So let's have Yuna. We can't really do ice stuff, but we can protect ourselves from fear. So let's do that. You saw it, you were watching a playthrough? Oh, yes. Okay, that wasn't really too helpful, was it? I think everyone did something at this point, so... Uh, okay, we can have Orin do uh, Magic Break. Because then its counters won't be as great. Okay, let's have Tita's speed up Lulu. There we go, because we're definitely gonna need all the all the all the spells to be happening. Oh god. Ew. We don't know which spell she's using, so we're just gonna bring Yuna into this and she's just gonna heal. She's gonna 
heal a lot because Auron is Auron needs a lot of health, honey. Right, we're gonna switch out Lulu for the time being. For can she heal? Is that something we we should we should be? Oh yeah, let's heal ourselves. We did magic break. Now we're gonna do power break. I don't know if it's gonna work regardless, but we're just gonna do it. Okay, got it. Uh, now Riku can do like water damage. I'm pretty sure she can do water damage. So we're gonna do like a grenade and like a fish scale. I think she has that. Yes. Okay, let's do that. Waterfall coming right up. That was pretty much Lulu's overdrive. <laughs> like, pretty much, right? It was pretty much the same thing. Uh, we hikey don't know what this honey is gonna do next. So, I'm gonna have Yuna. Let's summon Reginald. Because Reginald is um, elemental neutral. So, like, there's no elements here with Reginald. So, we're just gonna have Reginald do its ult. And we'll see what happens from there. And by ult, I mean overdrive. It's I'm, I'm speaking as if this is Overwatch. I'm sorry. So we're just gonna energy blast it. Kabloopies. Snatching wigs. <laughs> Oh, we killed it. Okay, stunning. Oh, a power strike. Oh, was that our first uh, 9999 damage? That was quite iconic. Okay, get it, Reginald. Fuck it up, girl. We did it. Oh, there's a sphere. Eject sphere. Ooh, that was that's a, a a lot of juicy. <gasps> yes, every oh everyone is like, everyone leveled up legit. That was good. <gasps> a level two key sphere, yas queen. Don't know if you can play it back. <clears throat> Jacked, left it here ten years ago. Ooh, drama. <gasps> play it back. <laughs> play it back. Mm -hmm. Do it now, bitch. What are you taking? Well, you said it was gonna be a long trip. We'll be seeing a lot of neat things, right? So I thought I'd record it all in this. What a vlogging Show legend. A kid, you know. Aww. Is cruise. Hey, Braska. Ain't this supposed to be a grand occasion? <laughs> We're the cheering fans, the crying women. <sighs> Fucking Jack. This is it. Too many goodbyes. People think twice about leaving. If you say so. Well, it better be a lot more colorful when we come back. A parade for Braska, vanquisher of sin. <laughs> we should go. He's like, anyway. <laughs> oh, sweetie. Oren, could you stand closer to him? Or I was like, really, do I have to? That should do it. What's the matter? Afraid I might bite. Jacked. Oh, sweetie. Braska, you should take one too. It'll make a great gift for little Yuna. Aww. I suppose. Are they like Braska, taking pictures? We shouldn't be wasting our time like this. What's the hurry, man? Oh, oh you know. Sin. Oren. Oren. Oren is like, turn that shit off. Let me, let me tell him some things. What's the point? He wasn't on some pleasure cruise. I think there's more. <laughs> Rico's like, uh, <laughs> there's more tea left. So. Hey. Oh. 
you're stuck in Spira like me. You might not know when you'll get back home, but you better not be crying. <laughs> wow. Although I guess I'd understand. But you know what? There's a time when you have to stop crying and move on. Okay, he's not wrong. Remember, you're my son. Ew, he made it he made it about him. Oh, sweetie. <laughs> Just when he was about to show some vulnerability, he was like, JK, bye, gotta go. Anyways, I believe in you. <gasps> Be good. Aww. Goodbye. Aww. There goes his daddy issues, am I right? It sounded almost serious, but it was too late. He was serious. Jacked had already accepted his fate. His fate? Jacked, he. He was always talking about going home to Xanarkin. That's why he took all those pictures. Aww. To show them to you when he returned. But as he journeyed with us and came to understand Spira and Braska's resolve, it happened gradually. But Jacked changed. He decided he would join Braska in his fight against sin. So then, he gave up going home? That was his decision. I guess I understood. <laughs> I My guess. Dad, he knew there was no way back home. Back to Xanarkin. He wanted to go home, but he knew he couldn't. He couldn't go on until he accepted it. Besides, even if he had found a way back, I don't think he would have left his friends behind before their journey was complete. He knows what's up. All right. Let's go, guys. Look at him understanding his dad. Maybe I had to start accepting my own fate. We love a self-discovering journey. Jack's spheres, spheres that document Jack's journey are hidden all over Spira, defeating the sphere morph has unlocked the seals that once bound the spheres. Find them. Yay, and Oren learns a new overdrive every time we find a Jekt sphere. So basically, every time we find one of their vlogs, <laughs> pretty much, uh, Oren gets a new, uh, a new overdrive. So that's quite iconic. And we also get to see what happened in Jekt's and Braska's and Oren's journey that's pretty cool let's level everyone up real quick let me get everyone together but i'm excited because we just got a level two sphere which we actually really needed in order to get um in order to get yuna's and lulu's paths a little more together yeah, it's right here. It's like, if we do this, Yuna can just, like, easily get Demi. And then she can go here. And she can get uh, these spells. I guess we would need a, a level 3 one to kind of, you know, backtrack. And get the things that we actually do need. <laughs> oh, no, there's another one. Where are we as Yuna? Okay, let, let me see my path. Let me see if there's another level 2 I can take. To get to... Oh, I can't. I can't get here. Oh. Yeah, then the closest thing is the level 3 one. So I think what we could do is we could go back a little bit as Yuna. And like... You know, we could go like this way, get Demi, and then keep going this way, get the good spells. And I guess if by the time we're here, we have what we need, then we can just like go through here and then go back to get what we need.
You know what I mean? But I don't know. That seems like it's a long, long journey. Hmm. I don't know. Maybe if we can get a level 3 one by the time we get up here. That would be great. Because I don't want to interrupt Yuna's path. So I think we're just going to do that. As Yuna, we're just going to keep going. I think as Kimari, we can blend in the two. And do that right now. But as... I don't think we should do that as... Um, as Yuna. I don't think we should ruin her path. Because that's a lot of backtracking. And I, I really don't want to do that. So we're just going to do this. We're just going to level everyone up. Lulu, she's supposed to go this way. Where is she going next? She's going... Oh, she's going this way. Yeah, so you want to get this. Then get over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. But as Kimari, I'm totally down to, like, blend the paths even more. I just wish I you, you, you could go from here to here. That would be so convenient. Um, but I guess as Kimari, we're just going to have to go this way. Get Kira. And then go through here. Yeah, and then go back and go through here. I think that's what I need to do. I think that's my path for now. Let me check if... Uh, just to make sure I'm not missing anything. Before I leave this section. I'm pretty sure we're good, but I just want to make sure we're not missing anything here. Wait. Yeah? Jacked loved you. Oh? Oh, come on, please. He just didn't know how to express it, he said. Hmm. Enough about my old man, okay? I just thought you should know. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. Thanks. He was actually happy to hear it. Aw. Turns out Titus is probably more similar to his dad than he would like to admit. Valley, how's it going, my legend? How are you, queen? How's it going? Yeah, I don't think there's anything else here for us to get, so. We good. Can we, bo can we go back through here, though? Okay, let, first of all, let me save so that we don't have to, to do that whole thing all over again. That was quite a lot of stuff. That we just went through. Like cutscenes, a boss fight. So let me not have to do that again. But I think we can go through here now. Yeah. I'm pretty sure there's stuff we can get. By going this way. I ate garlic bread on, to, for lunch. And it's giving me like. Very much like a lot of heartburn. <laughs> Not a lot, but enough for me to be able to feel it and be like, ooh. I'm good, just waking up, getting ready for work. How goes the stream? The stream is going well. We just pretty much, I guess we kind of just started. I was, I was, I, yeah. We kind of just got started with the game. We did talk a lot in the beginning of the stream. Uh, day 24, I know, yay. It's easier to get to Makalani Temple now that the road is open again. Yes. Okay, yeah, you're just gonna close it off because there's stuff that you don't want me to get to, you rude. Delfron, hi! How's it going? If you guys aren't following Valley or Delfron, you guys, you guys need to check your life because uh, you're not making good choices, okay? <laughs> They're both amazing streamers that you should be following. So, just saying. <laughs> but how's it going, Deli? You're back in Ireland, right? Are you are you suffering currently through um, jet lag? Is that a thing that you're 
that is happening. Yay, another Jack Sphere. I knew there was something here. Let's take a look. Let's look at, let's watch this vlog. What is this? Who are you? Ooh. Oh, is this when they met? The one they called Jekt. The man from Zanarkin. Are you not? I love that someone was what filming up? this. <laughs> Watch your tongue, Maeve. Ooh. A summoner. I've come to take you from this place. Mm, sounds sweet. <laughs> What's the catch? <laughs> that easy to see, was it? I soon leave on a pilgrimage to Zanakin. Seriously? Hmm. I would like you to join us. It will be a dangerous trip. I'm very Yet, much looking at his abs the whole time. <laughs> Sorry. My prayers will be answered. And you will be able to go home. We think. We think. What say you? Great, let's go. <laughs> he doesn't even think so about it. He's like, sure. Anything to get out of here. Well, I guess he does have a point. But I must protest. This drunkard, oh. a guardian? Oh. <gasps> Oren with the shade. You want to step in here and say that. What does it matter? No one truly believes that I, a fallen summoner wed to an Albed, could possibly defeat sin. This is what they say. Spoiler no alert, he did. This happened 10 years ago. Brasco, sir. <laughs> Let's show them they're wrong. Yes, Braska. Fallen summoner from Zanarkin and a warrior monk doomed to obscurity for refusing the hand of the priest's daughter Ooh. what delightful irony it would be if we defeated sin scandal get me out of here. Jax is like okay can we can we quit the chat like can we catch up after I'm out of uh, here uh, free at last now Jack. I am in your hands until we reach Zanarkin. Right, right. So, what's a summoner anyway? A summer summoner. Oh, sweetie. You regret your life right now? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. I bet it's yeah, I can I can only imagine how difficult it is like be spending time with someone you love for so long and then to have to like go back you know what I mean and just like go back as if nothing I guess it's not as if nothing happened but you know it probably feels a little like that like damn like now I'm just here we're on watch duty at the temple at least until the wedding's done anyone tries to crash our party we'll send them packing oh what a legend We've received several reports of summoners disappearing these last few days. Drama. Please be careful, my lady. This road leads to Bevel. You should hurry to the temple in Makalania. Noted. I was like, can we go this way now? Is that a thing? Puma just woke up and gave me kitty kisses. Aww, Puma. What a legend. What a cutie cute. What a cutie cute. It's not even a thing. Yeah, we're just gonna go back through here because I'm not about all the drama. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna skip over the drama and just head this way. Because <laughs> it's way quicker to get to where we need to go right now. Although we might need to do some um, grinding, maybe, possibly. I don't know, though. Probably not. Hopefully not, but we might. So I'm just going to save here after we did all of that. And turns out getting a Jack Sphere doesn't always mean that you get an overdrive. Because we just got a Jack Sphere and we got no overdrive.
for Oren. So that's that's also a thing. I I already see an all bed primer on the ground here. There you go. We pretty much got, got like most of that alphabet going on. Oh, hello there. So we are stealing from A would work, sure. Instead of Yuna, we can have Waka. Not Oren. Let's have Titus. Um Let's just do that to speed up the process. Look at her. She's like fully like twitching. You just ate breakfast? Nice. What did you eat? What did you get for breakfast? I mean, might as well try. Okay. I did try, though. Can't say I didn't try. Um, let's have Yuna pray or something. Or do this. Extractability. Very useful. We could always use some um, ability spheres. Orin and Kimari can attack, I suppose. Well, Kimari can do Lancet. I'm doing this so that everyone gets an opportunity to do something. So that everyone gets equal-ish amount of XP. That's what I try to accomplish with every single fight. That's why it takes me, uh, sometimes it takes me longer to get through certain parts. Oh wow, that was a lot of XP for everyone. Um, but that's why sometimes it takes me a little longer to get through certain sections. Because I really do like making everyone do something in every single fight so that everyone gets a little bit of something. Uh, let's check in with everyone here. What's up, girl? Hi there. Would you look at this? They always leave me behind. Oh, you want me to scratch you? Aww. There, good boy. Chocobos are so cute. How'd you know what it wanted? Uh, I've always been able to tell how chocobos feel. Maybe I'd make a better chocobo breeder than chocobo knight. Probably. Hey, what job do you see me doing? Breeder. Yeah, I think so too. Hmm. You know, I might just give it a try. Look at that. What a legend. Chocobos are so cute. However, if they were a thing IRL, I would be terrified. Imagine like horse chai horse chised horse sized chickens. That would be terrifying. Should I resign my commission? Would Captain Lucille let me? Elma would probably laugh at me. <laughs> wow, assholes. Wow, I think this is the first time I've seriously thought about my life. Oh. I think this but you know what I mean like they're cute in game and you're like oh my god cute but like if they were actually a thing they would be terrifying <laughs> I don't even like regular chickens Curse that really for taking up a place like this <laughs> Wow Waka. By tomorrow, all on account of this celebration thing. <laughs> hmm? what? You buying something from me? freaking go Waka. of course right. I knew I could count on you, lad. Yeah. We haven't been able to donate, which concerns me a little bit because it's like, is this the better is this the best we can get? First strike plus three. That's actually not bad at all. Ooh, magic plus five plus three and piercing. That's not bad at all either, because Kimari does have a lot of magic. 
So that's not bad at all. Strength plus magic. I don't know why Riku would need magic stuff. Okay, that's better. Silent Sword, sure. Ooh. Silent Sword is really good. So I'm kind of considering it. Ooh, this is good for Riku. She always has garbage health. She doesn't have a lot of HP going on for her, so that's pretty good for her. I guess we can get this one. And see maybe if there's something that we could make him learn or something. This one for Kimari also looks very good. It doesn't have sensor though, which concerns me. I like being able to see what's going on. But he doesn't... And yeah, he doesn't have st plus strength on that one. So I don't think we're going to do that one. Any items? Okay, the items are pretty much the, the standard. Uh, I wonder if there's something I could customize. That's a Kimari thing. I can only do strength plus three, which is not great. I could do piercing. I could do piercing here. Does it have sensors still? So I don't know how great that would be. Sorry for the yawns, y'all. Can't really control that, I guess. <laughs> oh, it was a defense item. Which one was it? Is it not here? Is it one of like... Oh, Kimari, Silence Ward, got it. What else can I get for him? I want a good ward. Oh, just kidding, we can get anything. <laughs> Ice proof, imagine. No. Automatically recover HP while walking. That's quite iconic, actually. How, what, what items does that waste? Stamina tablet. Okay. I don't even know where I got that. That's interesting. Okay. Work. Oh, hi. Encounter. Kind of concerns me that the enemies are able to do um, Blizzara spells now. That is quite concerning. But it's, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be completely fine. Miss me? Uh -oh. And let me bring Yuna so that she can do Null Frost. So that nobody snatches my wig. I mean, and by nobody, I mean the flan, because the other one can literally just attack me. Like that. So we want to attack this honey. And we want to bring Auron so they can snatch I it. See no difficulty. And then we want to heal as Kimari so the heat does something as well. Now we're going to have Riku steal. What else can we do here? Kimari already did something. Lulu hasn't done anything, but we can close the show with her in a way. Titus did something. Yuna has done something as well. We just need Waka and Lulu to do something. Titus already, yeah, Titus already killed one of the honeys. Let's have Lulu Let's end this. come around. Girl, I don't even know. I'm just gonna do Fyra. I'm just gonna do Fyra. Ooh. There you go. Ooh, yes. We stand a good old level up scenario. Oh, do I go through this way or the other way? 
No, I think this way, so I can get some accuracy, defense, and then do this, and then go up from there. Yes. I don't know why she would need accuracy or something like that, but you know, you never know, right? You never know, honey. You know, she's gonna keep going through her path. Kimari, you almost got the cure. I believe in you, Kimari. Who has a lot of stuff? I woke up early to come to the stream. Hi, Feather. How's it going? I really appreciate that. I really appreciate that. That's so sweet of you to do. That's really sweet of you, actually. Thank you so much for taking that time and to do that. Good morning. <laughs> you're doing good? Nice. That's good to hear. I'm glad you're doing well. Let's go in. Into the inn. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, hello there. Oh, you're that. You're that girl I thought you were. Okay, just kidding. No. Let me save. Before we do something, what you playing? Today we're playing Final Fantasy X. This is a game that is one of my favorites. Um, I do Final Fantasy games every Friday, and this was actually the first game that you guys, like the community, voted for. Um, I gave a little, everyone a little description of every game, and based on that, they chose this. So I'm really excited to play through this again. This is my first time playing the HD remaster though, so everything looks very nice. Um, especially for a game that was that came out in like 2004, it, this looks very nice. Um, and sounds very nice. It, it, this game definitely holds up really well, in my opinion. Why stop here? Kimari asking the real questions here. Kind of looks like Kingdom Hearts. I can, I can see where you can see that. It's made by the same company. It's made by Square Enix, so I can definitely see uh, how you would be able to compare them. Can happen. Make sure you're prepared, right? Ooh, Titus. Ne Titus needs to talk more like that. That was very attractive. Was on Kingdom Hearts inspired by Final Fantasy? Uh, not entirely. It's made by the same people. So the inspiration, it's gonna bleed through, right? Because it's 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 made by the same by a certain group of people. Say, hurry up and wait. It means prepare quickly so you're ready for whatever comes next. That's an interesting it saying. Like something an old man would say. Ooh! Forgive me. <laughs> Fuck that wig. The wig was taken. Hey, just being honest. <laughs> My God, hey. Titus. Um, but no, this game wasn't really in, like, I wouldn't say Kingdom Hearts was inspired by Final Fantasy. It was literally made, I think, people that worked on Final Fantasy games before worked on Kingdom Hearts. So it's just, I think, if anything, I think they were inspired by, like, the Disney concept and they wanted to mash a Disney concept with a Final Fantasy concept. And they kind of got, like, a middle ground there. Uh, and especially with the cameos from Final Fantasy characters as well, you know what I mean? Seriously, a wedding's not supposed to make people feel this bad, huh? It sure. On, don't say that. It sure isn't. <laughs> uh, I say what I want ever since I was a kid. Oh, so you're an adult now? <laughs> you know it. Oh my God. Anyways, how long are we supposed to stay here? You think? Girl, I don't know. Hey, don't ask me. Right? Like, bitch, don't ask me. complicated since Sororan joined us. Yeah, as if... You think so, too? As if this journey wasn't complicated to begin with. I always heard Kingdom Hearts is Disney meets Final Fantasy. I mean, it is. It definitely is. That's a very simple yet effective way of describing it. Uh, although, although Kingdom Hearts is more action RPG and this is an... A typical Final Fantasy is more of a turn-based RPG. The, the the newest ones aren't really that, but yeah. 
Zombie King, hello. How's it going? Still can't figure that guy out. What guy are you talking about, Waka? Are you talking about Oren? Mango, thank you so much for hosting the stream. Thank you so much. Mango Bale. Thank you. Yuna's really quiet. Sitting here like this, you really get to thinking. Right. Sitting here like this. Oh. Don't get too comfortable, Riku. What what's up, girl? Can we go now? I'm tired of waiting. Bitch, who are you to rush oh excuse you. <laughs> this bitch. Who are you to rush anyone after you took so long of a break when we were in the Thunder Plains, bitch? Can we go now? Did you forget who you are, bitch? I've heard Lady Yuna is to wed Maester Seymour. Who the fuck is spreading the rumors? I'd like to congratulate her. But it is a pity. I'd hoped Lady Yuna would defeat Sin and bring the calm to spirit. Excuse you. Yuna's still gonna journey. Yes, bitch! She's, she's an independent woman. Oh, that is also great news. Her resolve there you go. Let's known. clear the rumors, bitch. Just because she's getting married doesn't mean she's gonna settle down and like have his babies and not do anything with her life. Like, no, bitch. Would you like to hear about Makalanya? Sure, but before the... Uh, oh my god, I bit my tongue. Before the story time, um, let me just catch up with what you guys are saying. Uh, what are you doing in the game now? Basically, this game is about this group of people um, that is protecting a summoner, which is Yuna, which is the girl in the corner wearing the long dress. Um, in the in the right corner, I mean. Not the, not the black dress. She's a black mage. Um... Basically, we're going on this journey to save the world. Just, you know, to put it very simply, um, we're just, yeah, we're just gonna, we're just trying to save the world, defeat this creature called Sin, which, surprise, surprise, is supposed to be a punishment for the wrongdoings of society, which, you know, Sin, all that stuff. So that's quite delightful. And that's pretty much what we're doing, and uh, I guess you'll learn more as you go. And if you have any questions about specific stuff, I'll try and answer them for you. So feel free to answer questions, for sure. To answer questions, to ask questions. <laughs> and I will feel free to answer them. I thought she was pregnant or something, that's why they thought she couldn't do it anymore. No, basically she, um, the maester, aka I guess the, their equivalent of, of the pope, uh, basically asked to marry her because that would be a good distraction and everyone would be like happy about it it would give people something to look forward to I guess um, but she's very thought she's very torn about it because there's some tea that is yet to be spilled but she's a little torn about it, it seems uh, you have so many gems Ooh, what gems do you have uh, let's hear about Makalania. Makalania is the place we're at right now. So like the, you know, the frozen, frozen forest and such. This is Makalania. So let's go. Let's hear about it. Lake Makalania is frozen over all through the year. It stays frozen even on the hottest of days. It is said that the temple's faith is the cause of this fantastic phenomenon. And that is all for today. There you go. The faith is basically uh, the person a summoner prays to in order to get an Aeon. An Aeon is a summon, which it, it would be like, a, I guess, a Pokemon, to put it very, like, simply. Um, it's like, you know, we, we, we don't really capture these creatures, but we get them in temples um, through the faiths. Are you raising money for Christina? No. Um, the thing that you're seeing in the bottom of the screen is basically a fun little game that we do here, which basically is a little boss. So every time someone follows, gives uh, bits, every time they donate, every time they subscribe, um, the boss takes damage. And whoever defeats the boss becomes the boss. So Christina basically defeated whoever was 
the stream boss at the time and she became the boss so every time she donates every time she cheers every time she does anything she basically heals herself it's a little game that we do here uh, and i'm gonna try in the future to come up with incentives for like every time we defeat the boss i will do something but i still have yet to think about like whatever we we could do so if you guys happen to have any suggestions feel free to leave them in the um, in the feedback discord section uh or even in chat of course but i will most likely forget it if you don't leave it there as well um so yeah send christina to twitchcon fun <laughs> girl if anything i would be i would be raising money for myself to go to twitchcon like not saying she doesn't she wouldn't need it you know like you know what i mean like not saying she wouldn't appreciate it but it's way more expensive for me to go than for her to go. <laughs> uh, let's see what they're selling. Not the greatest of things, but this one is selling a variable mod, which means we could add other stuff to it to make it better. Which I wouldn't mind at all. Shimmering. Yeah, we could buy this one as well and add something else to it. And the Oh, this one we already have. So that's good. I think we could do that. Why do they sell a long sword? <laughs> it literally has... It literally does nothing. I don't know if you guys noticed that. It literally does nothing. I don't know why... Why they sell that? I'm thinking I'm, I'm gonna buy this. And also, no, not this one, this one. Yeah, and let me see. Thank you for your patronage, please use other agencies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let me see if there's stuff we can do with these new weapons. Like what we, what can we, what, 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 what can we add onto it? Uh, variable mog, okay. Distill power. Imagine adding strength <laughs> to a, a, a weapon. We could add magic plus three. It's not great, but we could add magic plus three. I think I'm gonna save up for if eventually we manage to be able to add more magic percentage instead of just three. I feel like three is kind of weak. Oh, sensor would be quite iconic. Actually, let me do that. Oh, it's a cactuar scope. Cute. Shimmering blade. Let me add sensor to this one as well. I want as many of them as possible. Ooh, actually, the steel ability is quite iconic. I think I want that. I think I want the steel ability. So that every time he attacks, uh, we get an ability. Not every time he attacks, but the monster he attacks... Uh, we get uh, ability spheres out of it, which basically means that uh, we can upgrade stuff. It's, it's, okay, it's complicated talk, okay? It's for the sphere grid. Every time you upgrade and you get to a, a, a grid, you basically have to fill it with whatever sphere belongs there. And if you don't have, like, if I get here and I don't have an ability sphere, I'm not able to get bio as an ability. So that's the kind of the short explanation for that. Uh, let me save, and let's talk to Yuna afterwards. I'm pretty sure um, there's probably a cutscene. Let's just see what she's up to. What's what's on her mind? Don't forget to smile. Remember? Oh, Aww. you're right. I'll try and remember. Cute. Smiling. Yes. Right. Keep at it. Very awkward conversations we're having, huh? Smiling. Yes. Right. Right. Anyway, <laughs> what else is happening here? Uh, I just realized I'm doing the Bachelor Challenge on The Sims 4 with a bisexual bachelor during Pride Month. Yes, Queen, like a true ally. <laughs> Like a true ally. That's amazing. Happy Pride Month, by the way, guys. I said it at the beginning of the stream, but for everyone who have 
who have joined since the beginning. A happy Pride Month. Hello, wonderful Ruby. How are you doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you so much for asking, Laster. Kind of bummed out that I didn't get any BTS tickets, but you know what? It is what it is. And um, we'll either get another opportunity to get tickets or I'm just going to buy a Switch later this year. So it's going to be fine either way. <laughs> Sorry to hear. No worries, honestly. It's just like, I, I was really looking forward to going, but it's like, if I, there's no, there's no point in me being like, you know, like moping about it or anything. Uh, you should just go to Paris for a vacation. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I think if I were to go, it would be because of the concert, not necessarily because I, I like have this thing of like wanting to go to France. Um, I don't even speak the language, so it's like, it's kind of that thing of like, you know, I don't, I feel like I would just be confused <laughs> a lot of the times. And things are very expensive in Paris. <laughs> like, I have, I, I have family that lives in France and they don't live in Paris because, in, like, Paris is literally super expensive. BTS have good music. Oh, I love them. And I, I literally spent my entire morning trying to get tickets to see them, but unfortunately it just didn't happen. <laughs> but I would love to see them live. They're amazing. I love them. Hopefully, since the tickets uh, in the U.S. tour, they ended up adding like a couple dates because it it like it uh, sold out super quickly. So hopefully they're gonna add more ear updates, either in the same places or in like new places in Europe. That would be amazing. Like if they came to Spain or Portugal, that would be iconic. But uh, I, would, I wouldn't I would be mad if they added other to, other dates to the places they, they already scheduled. But if not, like I said, maybe next year they will come and I will just use the money to buy a Switch and treat myself this year. And it's gonna be, it, it's gonna be what it is. Um. Tipo, hi. That blob looks like a Pokemon. It's a flan. <laughs> it's a flan. It's an ice flan. How's it going, Tipo? If you guys are not following Tipo, you should. You should follow him. Tipo is amazing. Tipo is also playing a Final Fantasy game on his streams. He's playing Final Fantasy VIII. Uh, which is another one of my favorites that we will definitely get into in the future. Uh, the flying eye does as well. They must have. They must be based off Pokemon. Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> there are Pokemon just like those. Uh, this game came out in like 2004, so you have to keep in mind that maybe Pokemon, like certain Pokemon that weren't really like this were a thing or whatever but i feel like they just in got inspired by the same sources that the pokemon creators got inspired from you know what i mean like pokemon gets inspired by uh mythological creatures uh by just your regular animals by uh japanese folklore and this game is is a japanese game so that could be why they're like creatures look similar to other games because they they basically take inspiration from similar places. So it doesn't necessarily mean that they're copying or that they're, you know, taking inspiration from Pokemon per se. Um but I they probably use the same uh sources of inspiration like that that Pokemon does. It does look like a yeah, it does look the every monster in this game and every creature in this game looks gives me a lot of a um, lot of Japanese folklore, uh, just general folklore with like um, like mythological creatures, um, gods, goddesses, uh, a lot of Greek stuff, a lot of um, Latin stuff, like with especially like if you read at like sometimes names of spells. And names of abilities. It's very like, um, and even locations in Final Fantasy, um, 
they definitely get inspired by like Latin stuff and like very old stuff and very like it. They basically take inspiration from just, I guess, art and like history, I guess. Sorry, that was a very long winded answer, but you know. I just feel like it's unfair to compare like a creature that obviously Final Fantasy didn't invent, but neither did Pokemon, you know what I mean? Um, very unlikely. Final Fantasy was created in the 80s, while Pokemon came around in 1996. Yes. Yeah, the, the original Final Fantasy came out in 1986. And some of these creatures are actually remodels of old ones. So, um, like, it, it's just, like, new versions of old creatures that they came up with in 1986. You tipped me? Um, I don't see anything. I should get a notification when it goes through. Um, welcome back, Pixels. Welcome back. And of course, thank you, Valley, for the loots command. If anyone would like to tip for free, uh, of course, it's not as much money as it would be if you, you know, whatever. But, you know, each, each uh, loot is equivalent of a bit and a half. So uh, it's completely free and it's completely, um, I guess, hassle free. You did it on loot and it said in an hour? Th did it, did it go through? Hmm. Maybe there's some sort of, um, maybe, maybe there's some sort of cooldown or something. Uh, because I don't, I don't think it got through. I think the latest, the last one I got was from David. Um, so yours di didn't come through yet. I see Valley's is already in the queue. Um, but I don't see, I don't see anyone else's. So I don't know, I don't know what happened. You're gonna lurk a bit, you're cooking. Ooh, what are you cooking, Tipo? Let us know. I guess when you're done cooking, so that, you know, you don't burn anything. <laughs> Cook away, yes, please. Enjoy the foods. Have to go, have to go to gym, BB, have a wonderful stream. Thank you so much, Lasser. Enjoy, have fun at the gym. Or gym class, whatever you're doing. <laughs> Either, either or. <laughs> Have a good time. Thank you so much for stopping by here. Uh, yes. No, we're not healing anyone. We're doing... This. There goes my water. I'm gonna need more water soon. Okay, Titus already did something. Waka, I'm pretty sure already did something. So we just need Oren, Yuna, and Lulu to do something. As you wish. So Yuna. What can Yuna do? Just pray. <clears throat> I guess that would work. Ooh, what if the Sailor Moon game was set up like Final Fantasy? That way you could switch out what scout to use. Valley, you need to look up um, what game would be a good example. Okay, like Tales of... I guess any Tales of game, like Tales of Zisteria or Tales of uh, Zillia. Um, those are, like, I can definitely imagine a Sailor Moon game being made by the same people who make those games. Because those games are so anime-inspired, and you have, it's like, they're RPGs, but they're not, like, turn-based. So, like, it's kind of, like, action-y. Um, like, you, you need to look up gameplay of, of, like, any of those games, because I feel like Sailor Moon would work perfectly perfectly with those because you can even switch them out in the middle of the action like you can switch out people depending on 
the abilities that you need or that you could use. So like Tales of Zillia was a good one. So this is how you spell that, I guess. This, um, I think that's how you spell that. You need to look up like gameplay, especially in the fight sequences. You need to look. You need to look it up because I Sailor Moon would be um would be perfect if it was made by those people, or in the same or in a similar style of that. That would be amazing. Either that or um similar to Nino Kuni, but without the summoning aspect, just with the action aspect. But it would be pretty much the same thing as Tales of Zelia, without the um, without the I guess the Pokemon E aspect of it. Oh, there you go. I see. I see the tip feather. I see the tip that you sent. It's still in the queue because they have a little cooldown, so that the loots don't get spammed. But I see it. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Oh, that that was unfortunate, wasn't it? Now I'm, I'm excited to see what Valley would like after she watches it and she I'm excited to see what her reaction would be to a game in that in that genre I guess or even if it was more actiony I can see Sailor Moon being more actiony with RPG elements for sure but I can see it being a little more in the vein of uh, I guess Bayonetta in the gameplay aspect, but like with or even Kingdom Hearts in a way with like some platforming, you have a party of people, you can switch around, you can like Final Fantasy 15 as well would be a good idea of like having a squad and then in the battles you can switch them in and out. Um, I could see it for sure, right? Sailor Moon needs to be a little more action-y, in my opinion. But I will take whatever they give me, bitch. If they give me any Sailor Moon game, I'm gonna get it. Thank you for the loots, Valley. <laughs> Twerks so Ruby gets loots. Thanks. I appreciate it so much. Thank you so much. And, uh, by the way, if you guys uh, connect your Twitch account to your loots, to the loots account, um, you can... Um, you can be a part of the leaderboard and win a free sub. Drama. Surprised you decided to come so soon. Pleasantly surprised, of course. Of course. Lord Seymour sends his apologies for having left without notice. Right. It's quite all right. I have one question, if I may, sir. Milady. I want to keep journeying. Even if I marry, do you think that Maester Seymour would let me? But of course, my lady. Lord Seymour wishes nothing else, I'm sure. Uh, goodbye. Bitch, what do you mean goodbye? We're your guardians. We must follow Grotto tradition. I'll have to ask you to wait here a little while longer. Guado tradition. Um, I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like having her by herself with the Guados. That was your line. Yuna. Shantae, you stay. Thank you for the host. Thank you, Amethyst. Oh, no! Old drama. I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Sorry. It's just that drama is going down right now. And we have to... We have to... Go to the frozen lake and, 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 and save the situation. Stand back. This is exactly why Yuna needs to be with her guardians at all times. Lady Yuna. Aww. She was like, no, bitch. She's like, I'm fighting too, bitch. Don't interfere on... Oh, I couldn't read all of it. 
we haven't unlocked enough information to know what it, to decipher everything they're saying. Well, here they come with a, a, a machine. Our precious, your precious magic and aeons are cancelled. I think that's what he said. Get them. Okay, that's easy. <laughs> we have like half of the alphabet at this point. So we I can pretty much understand what they're saying. But how's it going, Amethyst? Sorry, there was a cutscene, so I, I, I didn't really want to interrupt it too much. His hair. Why is his hair look so stiff? I think they kind of took inspiration from, like, Medusa when it came to the Guado hair. You know what I mean? It, it looks very much like... It looks like like animal animal an animal esque in a way like it looks you know what i mean it's hard to explain negator disables all magic and summoning got it so we know what to target don't we we're just going to have riku steal shit obviously so we need waka Thank you so much for the loot feather. Here's the tip. Thanks. That's so nice. That is. Oh wow, Waka. Fuck. We may be a little over leveled right now, which is not that bad. You can barely hear me. Are uh, really? Is that better? Oh, is the game too loud? What is that? Like, is that good? I just don't want to be too loud. I don't want to be peeking in your ear. A little booty popped up on the screen. I click it. Yay! You got you get extra rubies. You get extra rubies by doing that. You hear me fine? Okay. I just turn it up a little bit. Just to make sure it's not too loud, but it's still like, you know, you can still hear me. Um, <laughs> I see, I see your loot already, Shadow. Yes, the loots and cookies. <laughs> I appreciate it. Tap his booty to get extra rubies. Yes, poke the booty and get extra rubies. Oh God. It's a crawler. I don't think we get any extra stuff. But, yeah. I figured I would give it a try anyway. Oh, God. Oh, wow. That was, that was a little extreme. By the way, Riku is an all bad, so it's a little... It's a little concerning that they're still willing to attack her like that. Did someone just knock on my door? I don't think so. Uh, what am I doing? Oh yeah, we, we used thunder on it. Stop it. It's not poke Cassie anymore. It's poke the booty. <laughs> Me when I'm home alone and there and there's a knock. I'm not home alone though, but you know. No, I think it was like sometimes you open a door and there's a window open and sometimes the door is just like not not shake necessarily, but you know what I mean? There's a little something that happens to the doors. The combos I come into. <laughs> Poke the booty. <laughs> Honestly, you do walk in into very awkward timings, don't you? <laughs> That's the beauty about my stream, though. Mana beam, not on my watch, sister. It's a skill she has, honestly, right? Shadow just knows. Shadow just knows when to show up. Honey, you're gonna 
Your turn is not gonna come anytime soon, honey. We slowed you down, sweetie. Um, okay, let me have Oren. Waka and Riku did something, so let me have Oren do something. Get that money, Valley. Yes, I really do. I have a talent. Yes, <laughs> you really do. Let me give this to Lulu. Okay, now we're gonna switch to Yuna. We're gonna overdrive as Reginald. Wait, how many how much health does it have? Okay, that's quite a lot. We can we can do that. Let's let's do that as Reginald. Thank you for the loot shadow. Really appreciate it. Go, go, Reginald, go. By the way, guys, today we might get a new Aeon. So uh, you might, if you want to be named, if you want an Aeon to be named after you, you might, you might want, you might want to stick around. Well, that didn't really work, did it? Stop attacking. <gasps> no, we didn't even get to do the overdrive. Oh, I feel betrayed. I should have just I should have just done it. I'm stupid. Oh, I wasted that. God damn it. And now there's a, a mana beam happening in one turn. Oh, sweetie. Well, that happened. Yes, let's try and snatch as much as we can before the mana thing goes off. Oh, I was like, what the fuck just happened? I was like, why is she bending over? And then I was like, oh, she's dying. <laughs> Work has been super busy and I love it. Yes. You walk in on the weirdest thing in people's stream. <laughs> That's amazing. Hey, I'm at my grandparents. Sorry for not being here last stream. Like, slash, like, half of this one. No worries. I'm not, like, keeping track of... Um, this is not, like, math class. You guys don't have to be here every day. I understand that life is a thing <laughs> that you guys need to do. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. That bitch is back. It's okay. Oh, all magic and summoning. Well, fuck my drag. Uh, can we do... Oh, shit. Oh shit, this is the worst timing in the universe. Oh no. Because it's gonna do the, the, the cannon thing. Oh my god. Fuck. I won't be able to summon. Well then. She can't even use magic. I don't know why I tried doing that. Um, well, I guess we can do this to at least get rid of that. I hate it. Please don't kill me. Okay, that wasn't too bad. That could have gone worse, right? I need to absolutely heal everyone. You just found your DS? <gasps> yes! I wish that DS's, like, you didn't have to mod, not to mod, yeah, mod them in a way, to, uh, in order to be able to capture them. 
because like you could easily just get a, a cheap DS and like you know what I mean, like an old DS and buy and play all the all the games. <sighs> but he can't. It's so annoying. And it's so expensive to buy a capture card. We talk about this all the time though. Is protect a thing we can do? We have shell. Not really useful, you know. Protect would be more useful, but, you know, it is what it is. Oh, I can't really... Well, let me just heal before something crazy happens. Mana bean in three turns. Honey. Did I say bean or beam? <laughs> I feel like I said bean and it's definitely not a bean. Anyway. God damn it. Ooh, let's do a Fury. Thundara, get it. Oh my god, why is- Oh, I was rotating it the wrong way. <laughs> Ew, this is so not good. Whatever. Oh, sweetie, you tried. Okay, listen, Linda. I thought that said Fury. Furry. Oh, <laughs> that would definitely be very different. <laughs> very different. <laughs> that would be very different. <laughs> Fucking Kimari. Okay, god damn it. I probably need to be a little more careful about my friends here. Plot twist, bitch. You're not going to be able to do what you want to do. Because I'm going to call upon David. Which I should have done already a long time ago. And this fight would have been over by now. But I didn't really remember it. Or I was waiting for the right time. But, I was, but now I was like, well, fuck the right time. I'm just going to do it. Whatever. Because I wanted to time it so that the Aeon would protect us from the, um, from, the sh from the beam. But I didn't time it correctly last time. So I'm just going to go for it. And I'm just going to... Um, I'm just going to have David do Thor's hammer. Have you seen your own ult now? I, I don't think you have. Either way, here's David's ult. Slash Overdrive. I guess that's the right name for it. Yay, me. <laughs> Boop. Goodbye. You get more... You get more stuff when you do Overkill anyway, so it's fine. Ooh, that was a lot of juicy. Look at all of that AP, bitch. Yes. Uh, queen. Milady. Anyway, let's go. Bye. Rico. I will tell father. I am the Garden of Yuna, you see. Yuna is safe. We will... Something, something. <laughs> I told him I was a guardian. Well, I guess I had to, really. How come you speak out bed? Oh, sweetie. Uh, well, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Me. I'm out bed. And that was my brother. You knew 
Oh, Waka is not having this. Why didn't you tell me? We knew you'd be upset. This is great. I can't believe I've been traveling with an Albert Ahidra. <gasps> wow. Wrong. We have nothing against Yevon. But you Albert used to forbid him mocking us. You know what that means? Sin was born because people use mocking us. You got proof? Show me proof. Ooh. It's in Yevon's teaching. Oh, not that you know. Oh. That's not good enough. Yevon says this. Yevon says that. Can't you think for yourself? Ooh. Well, then you tell me. Where did Sin come from? She huh? snapped. I, I don't know. <laughs> you bad mouth Yevon, and that's all you can come up with. But it doesn't mean you should do whatever they say without thinking. Nothing will ever change that way. Nothing has to change. You want Sin to keep coming back? There might be a way to stop it, you know. Sin will be gone once we atone for our past mistakes. When? How? If we keep faith in Yevon's teachings, it will be gone one day. Why do I even bother? She's not having any of this. Hmm? Will this move? Yes. We're not using that, are we? Wait. So Auron is an oh my God. Uh... Come on, Waka. What? I mean... Getting angry just because you found out Riku's in our bed. You guys got along fine till now, didn't you? That's different. I mean, is it the Waka? I don't claim to know that much about Spira, and I probably know even less about the Al bed. But sorry, Waka is literally that person that is like cool with everyone, and then it, when he, he's like that guy that when he found finds out you're gay, he's like. Wow, you, how dare you? No, this is not okay. This is not, no, why, no. And you're like, bitch, the fuck? Like, you just, like, just before you knew I was just a great human being, wasn't I? Like, what, what, what changed? Like, are you, are you okay? Like, is there, is anything, is like, are you okay mentally? It says on the Bible, I just, got, I just got three more massages next week. That makes seven. What is happening? I'm never this busy in the summer. Yes, bitch. Get it, Valley. That's why I hate it. Walk up. But I know Riku's a good person. She's just Riku. She's just Riku. Just think of this as an opportunity to learn more about the Albed. <laughs> oh, racist Waka. Give him time to think. Done nothing to apologize. Oh, they're defending right. her. Right. You sure you know how to drive this? <laughs> Kimari, it's like, I got it. Better than Kimari does. <laughs> wow, what does that mean, Titas? He got it. Oh, we have we we got Lulu with us, the queen herself. I hope that you're not too mad at Waka. Hey, not at all. Thank you. Why do you care, Lulu? Hmm? Say, what do you think of Riku? Me? She's... fun to be with. <laughs> she's... <laughs> fun. She's like, sure. Yeah, I can tell she's not a bad person. Yeah. You know what the problem is? She's just another Albed to Waka. Sounds like a, a sounds like a Waka problem. I bet it's because of Yevon, or you know, something like that. Well, there's more to it than that. Hmm? Waka doesn't like the Albed because of his brother Chafu. Oh, he used a Machina weapon, right? And got killed by Sin. Killed by my old man. <laughs> Lulu's like, wait, what? <laughs> hey, can someone like a human become Sarah? When he spills the tea. I can't say that I know. But why? Just a thought. Sin is the punishment for and the incarnation of crimes we have committed. Uh, so no one really knows what it is. There's no need to know, so no one asks. Is there really no need to know? It's really all you can do. There's no sense brooding over it. What, that's all? 
I mean, you don't even wonder. Right? <laughs> you really do come from a world where there is no sin, like you say. Yeah, bitch. I haven't been lying to you this whole time. What do you mean? Oh, you really do, huh? It's like, bitch, yes. I've been saying that the whole time. <laughs> I love Lulu, though. Even though she's kind of like defending Waka, I'm like, bitch, shut up. Like, no. I love how Lulu keeps it all cool. Like, she rarely gets mad. I know. Lulu is everything I ever aspired to be in life. She's just... She's such an iconic queen. I just love her with all my heart and soul. And she gets shady as fuck. <laughs> and she's shady. She's like, she's a true queen. She is, she gets very shady and sassy with the folks. She's like, honey, no. <laughs> she will talk all the shit. Right? I want to have a fur collar and pants made of belts, too. <laughs> Honestly, like a whole gown made of belts. <laughs> Legendary. We can threaten monsters now? That's the thing we can do now? Where are we going? Oh, okay, got it. Am I going down? Oh, this spell. Oh, this is like a Yuna thing. I think I'm supposed to go up. What is there anything here I could learn? Reflect. Protect. Mm. Yeah, I don't think it's worth it to do that as Riku. So we're just gonna go this way. We're just gonna keep going with her path. Although she does have some MP, so I could have done that, but whatever. Lulu is the Queen of Shade. She is a black mage. It's true, she is. She is a black mage, so there's plenty of shade there. We, we're missing Yuna because she went on ahead without us. And somehow, even though we used a Machina, she arrived before us? How does that work? Because we all know that Yuna is not the fastest walker. Not with that tight dress, she's not. So... Um, how did that work exactly? <laughs> Let me just track. Uh, I guess we can track back a little bit and um. Wait, we're gonna we're gonna go this way anyway in the future, right? So it's not like we need to we need to go through all of these shenanigans right now, right? Because we're gonna go this way anyway eventually. So I don't think I, I, I actually need to... Like, go back. We are, though, getting very close to... Um... We're getting really close to getting another, another Aeon, so that's pretty exciting. Waka's head looks so weird there. That was such a bad angle for him. That was actually hateful. Like, that was so bad. His head looked huge. Uh, I don't think Kimari and Lulu have done something, so I'm gonna, ha I'm gonna have them do stuff. Well then, what next? 
like focus, for example. Or reflex, sure, that works. Now we just need Kimari to do something. Honestly, just heal yourself, to be honest, and then have Waka finish the, the thing off. That wind was so awkward. <laughs> So I don't think we need to backtrack, actually. I don't know. Should we do it, guys? What do you think? Should we backtrack and get some XP and get the items that were left behind while we were doing that cutscene? Or should we do that on our way out of here? Yeah, I don't know. I'd say you do it out. Yeah, so I don't have to do it two times. I guess we can always do that in case I need XP. <laughs> I guess I can do that if I need XP. L Lost my gang. Here you go. It's called Ain't It. You'll, you'll backtrack later anyway. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Look at this temple. This is so iconic. This is going to be a good one, y'all. And there's going to be plenty drama to, as well. There's plenty... I mean, we're going to meet Seymour. So, uh, la every time we meet with Seymour...